Hey, what's up, guys? It's Will here. Welcome back to the channel. Thank you guys for joining me once again on this beautiful Sunday. Happy Mother's Day to you and your mom. To anybody, shout out to all the moms out there in the world. But in today's video, I'm going to be talking about stacking in Warzone because I've been playing a lot of ranked play with my cousins and with um, some of their friends. And the biggest problem that I've seen with Warzone is stacking, right? I've seen it all over Twitter, all over YouTube. And I'm going to see if it's consistent or not. I'm just going to be talking about it. And I'm going to be going over if it's ruining Warzone, if it's good or bad to do, what makes it right or wrong, and if team stacking is ruining the game for a majority of people. But in my opinion, I really do think that team stacking is a very situational thing that's good and bad, that is right and wrong. And there's right ways to team stack, there's wrong ways to team stack. Like, there's good reasons to team stack, there's bad reasons to team stack. But that's my take on it. But I'm going to be talking about the majority of players, what, you know, other people are saying, what different kinds of players like yy solo players that push everyone and team based players say first thing i want to talk about is it ruining warzone i think it is but it doesn't really happen to me every game and it's really all depends on how i'm playing and what kind of play style i'm going for in that game and what i mean by that is that like some players a lot of players like me actually they push some games where they're like they're on fire they're pushing every team pushing everybody and winning every fight other players just like to sit back and you know, just chill. I, I just whiffed that. We just team stacked right on that guy and that whole entire squad. But I think it's a very situational thing. I also think it is ruining Warzone in in a um, sense. Like, you have to play smart to really, uh, you know, not get killed by team stacking and complain about it. Right? So, I think in a sense, it's ruining Warzone. But it really depends on, like, the kind of player you are and all that stuff. Because... For people that just sit back and, you know, just chill all the time, it's good for them to team stack and all that stuff. Other times, it's, you know, if you're pushing, it's, it's not really fun for you. So it really depends on your play style, I think. Another thing I want to talk about, is it good or bad? I feel like it's a mix of both, you know? I'm playing like shit, dude. I was on fire yesterday. But I think it's a mix of good and bad. You know, it really depends on, like, what the situation is. There we go, he's dead. But he wasn't even looking at me. That's not looking. But yeah, I think it's a mix of good and bad, dude. Because, man, it's a very situational thing to, like, have to team stack. Like, in rank, I'm team stacking a lot. But in pubs, bro, if I'm playing quads, dude, or we just don't want to play ranked at all, we are just pushing everybody, right? But, like, I also think it's a good thing to do if depending on the situation, you know, and, like, all that stuff. But I feel like it's bad to do if it's your whole entire, like, you know, play style. That, uh, that's when it's bad. But it's going to do when, like, you know, you're only doing it when you're in a bad spot like when you have no plates no armor no loot all that stuff but i i think it's absolutely horrible to do if you do it every single game and you're completely fine with that because like for a majority of players they want to get good at the game so why don't they like oh my god what are these guys doing bro but yeah like people who make their play style that 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 like kind of thing it's just super annoying man but i could also see like the appeal of why people defend it because like dude like man you don't always want to play the same way like, every single time dude it's really not that fun by the way this morse and this freaking rival nine is hitting like crack i've been trying to keep it a secret but i'm using it in the video no one's looking at me uh, but yeah like Coming, holy crap! Next, and then the next thing I want to talk about is what makes it right or wrong. Um, Jesus Christ! I really just feel like it's literally it makes it right to do if you're just in a bad spot. Like it's all situational, in my opinion, dude. But like for the majority of players, people are saying like if you're in a team-based mode, don't push, don't push by yourself, which that totally makes sense. But dude, like I, I could definitely see like why people um, why this guy pushing by himself. I am out. I'm by myself, bro. But yeah, like, for a majority of players, on all the three tops I talk about, if it's Runic Warzone, is it good or bad to do? What makes it right or wrong? It's all... A majority of people are saying that it's completely bad to do. Right? But a, a different genre of players, like YY and players that push all the time, they're saying, like, you guys should not be team stacking and you guys should, you know, be playing apart. If you're in a team-based mode, in my opinion, if you're in a team-based mode, you should not be complaining at all. Like, you should not be complaining at all. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What the hell? I just got lasered. And I just, somebody got shot fisted. Holy shit. I feel like 
if if you're in a team based mode, because a, a lot of the majority of the casual players are saying that it's good to team stack in team based modes, but if you're solos and you're stacking with somebody else, like indirectly and shit, like that's that's also bad to do. But like I feel like team stacking in general, all like it, it's very situational in my opinion, but like with the majority of players, bro, it's it's I don't even know how to explain it, man. It's right to do in certain situations, but it's wrong to do. That that's my Thing. It's good to do in certain situations, it's bad to do in other situations. But I, I just don't understand how, like, argument of team stacking and team-based modes is bad. I, I don't get that. Like, you're in a team-based mode. If you want to push everybody, like, if you want to kill everybody, dude, go play solos for that. There's a game mode for you. It makes really no sense for people to complain about it. I, but I, I personally just feel like it's very situational. And then the last thing I want to talk about, does team stacking ruin the game for the majority of players? I mean, it ruins the game for anyone that dies to it, in my opinion. You know, anyone that dies to team stacking, like, it ruins their entire game. But is it ruining Warzone? I, I just don't think so, because, like, the majority of people are saying it's good to team stack. Like, if you're team stacking in a solo game, I think that's when it gets bad. But if you're team stacking in a team-based game and, you, and, it, and it's all bad situation you got no plates or anything like that i see why you would team stack i just think that overall it's very situational it's good and bad to do it's right and wrong there's no like you know 100 good answer i think the problem that a lot of players have is that you you guys that say team stacking is good you guys make it your entire play style this isn't good Shit on. <laughs> he said I hit the craziest shot on that guy. I did not. I did not. Okay, why why are these guys just fighting? Holy crap. If we we're actually able to win this, I'll be Dead. But yeah, like I just think that if you make it your entire playstyle, that's when that's when you're just like you're just you're just such a horrible player. I hate I like I, I don't I just dislike those kind of players. You know what I'm saying? Like, I just hate that. Hopefully, these guys know what to do with the buy. Dead. Oh, I'm dead. Super dead. Oh, my God. What is this guy doing? Like, see, that's when it's good to team stack, bro. My God, this is bad. Somebody has a reinforcement player plate on them. He's just not using it. Hopefully, this guy does not die. Give up, dude, please. Yes! Guys, he's one shot, 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 get him, he's killing me, he's finishing me, he's one shot. Oh, we're dead. <laughs> but yeah, obviously, I think it's just, I don't know, it's just, it's ruining the game for a majority of players that are good when, you know, like, people are team stacking. But all overall, I think that it's a very situational thing, but I could see where it could be annoying and shit. But like I said, like I just said, I think it's very situational. It's good and bad to do, it's right or wrong to do. Is it ruining Warzone a ton? Only if you're a YY push player, right? And or someone that pushes all the time, right? And or someone that's just in a solo situation. So I think it ruins Warzone sometimes. It's not ruining Warzone right now. Not a lot of people are doing it, right? But yeah, it's been your boy, the middle guys. Drop a like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.